Hello, and welcome to Pi, Projects, Ideas, and Experiments. In today's video, uh, it's a little different, um, so enjoy. So I had a bit of an interesting morning on my uh, way to work this morning. Um, I rescued a puppy. Get him, get him. Oh, no, 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 no. Where'd he go? Oh, God, get, get out of the road. Get out of the road. Get out of the road. God, where'd he go? I don't want to run him over. Shit. Okay, I don't know how this is going to work, but I'll figure something out. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. oh god, oh it's okay, it's okay, we'll figure something out, we'll figure something out, I think I just got me a dog. Sometimes things happen. Oh boy. It's okay. I don't know what I'm going to do with you, how this is going to go, but what I'm going to do while you're... Uh, unfortunately, it did make me a little bit late for work, um, but if people have a problem with that, well... <laughs> um... Anyway, so, unfortunately, I know I can't keep the, the cute little thing. Um, apartment situations and being what they are. I'm going to at least go see if, if it's microchipped. And uh, maybe see if I can either locate an owner or maybe a shelter that can take it. Uh, maybe a family member or a friend or co-worker or somebody that can... Watch out for it while, you know, I try to figure out what to do. Um, but anyway, uh, I guess without further ado, here's the, the, the little thing that almost got ran over three different times and I 
held up traffic to rescue it. Let me get this flipped around and you'll see, you'll see the cute little furball. This is the cute little furball. Um, unfortunately, I had to uh, be at work at 6 o'clock. Like I said, I was running a little late. This little guy, or girl, not really sure, have not checked the undercarriage, uh, was running in the road and, uh, like I said, stopped traffic, rescued it, and, uh, yeah, and, uh, anyway, had to leave him in the car for, it's been almost three hours now, um, but he did good, no messes, no, no nothing, so, uh, no wet spots, no, no piles, nothing shoot up, nothing, so, uh, apparently he's a good pup, so, I just gotta figure out what to do. I'm gonna, I could see what I can do, and, I don't know, well, I'll, I'll go from there, I guess. Uh, I guess I'll keep people updated? Maybe. Anyway, um, so that was that was my morning. All right, so I am at the shelter. Unfortunately, they're well. I guess it's technically a good thing. Um, they're actually doing a reduced or free pet vaccination, so it's a little crowded. I got to carry the guy in and uh, see what they say. Hopefully, he's microchipped or something, or they can help me out in some way. Um, maybe they'll even let me record this. I don't know. Right. Unfortunately, um, little furball is not microchipped, um, so now I gotta figure out what to do, cause I gotta be back to work in a few hours, and I can't take him home. Um, I'm gonna try to make a few phone calls, see what I can do. Um, I don't know what to do. Uh. I'll figure something out. Everything happens for a reason. Alright, so, um, we've got a family member, my cousin and his family, um, are possibly going to take the little pupper. And, uh, his mother in law may take the, the pupper. Kind of depends on, you know, I guess, who wants it more. Um, but, uh, about to drop them off and uh, see how they do. Okay. All right. So this is my cousin, and uh, they are going to uh, accept the puppy for now, and whether they end up keeping it, <clears throat> or uh, um, a family member of theirs takes it, that'll, I guess, be decided in the future. They have to uh, wait and see how their dog interacts with the, with her as well. Found out it is a girl. And, uh, yeah, so, to a good home she goes. All right. Got anything you want to say? No, no, but we'll, we'll find her a good home if she doesn't stay here. <laughs> All right. Well, at least it's a happy ending. It's going to be. All right, so they are bringing in their dog well, to see how he boy. does. Good boy. Good boy. Let's see. Oh, look at it. So far, so far, so good. They're, they're holding him back just so he doesn't startle the poor pup. She is just content as can be. Right? And a well, so far so good. Hopefully everything goes goes pretty well. Yeah, I don't I don't know if she's how she feels about it. Let's see. She seems like she wants to be right here. <laughs> it's that safety comfort for, that she has. Maybe we'll, we'll just give it a second. And give him a minute to calm down. Right. 
He's so excited. He's like, I got a playmate. That she is. Like I said, the whole the whole car ride over, she was just, you know, laying in the passenger seat, you know, just being being cute, of course. Well, of course, of course. Who knows what other animals she's been around? <laughs> who know? Who knows what she had to deal with on the streets? He's he's so excited. I don't know who's going to be more excited, him or the girls. <laughs> Chilling. She's yeah. I find it funny that Scruffy's making more noise than she is. He's he's just very <laughs> excited. Right. Have you? She's walking and everything. Okay. Right? Yeah. I just haven't seen her actually right. walk. Well, she was running through the road, so. Oh. Look at those ears. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he wants to grade her so bad. But she for sure didn't get hit? As far as I know, she didn't. She got close when she ran under the car that was trying, the person in front of me was trying to save her too. And, uh, she went under the car, then he pulled away because he couldn't get to her. She's like, okay. Yes, he wants to go to her. Yes, he wants to get the floor going. Okay, well. Yeah, this way. They gotta do the sniff test. <laughs> well, well, okay. Do dogs will be dogs. Yep, yep. Oh. Good boy, Scrub. Good boy. Ooh. Hey, you cuffed up a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Good yeah. boy. <laughs> She's wagging her tail. She's wagging it. Yeah. Yeah. Get closer. Yeah, I'm trying to get her, give her on this side a bit. He's bigger, and he's going to be a little bit more intrusive. Right. Right. So far. And now she's walking around. She's already trying to explore. Oh, oh, I think. Oh, and he goes. She goes right back to, to you. Just to, like, it's safety. They're just feeling each other out. Right. They're both wagging their tails. Aww. Well, I think we made a good choice. I, I, I think I think your mother may be out of luck. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, I guess this is a deciding factor here. And uh Well maybe have a couple updates. So the first thing they did 
was give the cute little pupper a bath. Um, I don't think she liked it too much, but it was necessary to get her clean. She stayed with my cousin for quite a while and uh, did very well. Got tired out from the first couple of nights. They ended up giving her a little trim and a haircut. She looks beautiful. She was very happy. She even handled traveling and going to the vet. She did very well and was healthy. My cousin's mother-in-law did end up taking her. She has been very well taken care of. She is very loved and she has found her forever home. She gets plenty of attention and I still get to see her from time to time. Her new name is Misha. I will miss this pupper, but at least I still get to see her sometimes.